你去，你去。Our employer TSC Nancy Masharia, who you know we, you are getting this, you should come out clearly and issue out the letters under permanent and pensionable terms. We need to be aware of what we are starting to do come January. You know, it saddens us when we, the people who graduated earlier and were employed in internship terms, in between the years we work, some people who are younger than us are given the chance to apply for permanent and pensionable terms. There were replacements which happened just recently. We were barred from applying for those things. While our fellow counterparts, the people who we left in campus, the people, some of who we taught while we were in teaching practice, were given letters. They went and applied for replacement. They were given letters. Right now they are teaching in senior secondary schools and in permanent and fashionable terms. So how are they supposed to perceive me? How are they supposed to respect me? And I taught them. Another thing, we have seen uh, the, the, the ministers, the MPs going around, issuing letters to their kinsmen, issuing letters, some of them to even their girlfriends. They don't even consider the year of graduation. So how am I supposed to respect my profession? How am I supposed to operate? We uh, mimi ni mekasirika ama ni na makasirika sana, ama ni na uzuni sana, kuhusiana, kuhus o kwa kwa mimi ni mwalimu wa JSS, na tuliweza kuwa employed and... Uh, contract eh? that is internship and then the letters were very clear whereby we were told that it, uh, it was supposed to be it was nani renewable one year contract and by ilikuwa nani renewable and now we are very much uh, uh, we are very much annoyed over the same because the government is busy saying that we were employed and it has employed 56,000 teachers of which we were worried. Where are these 56, where are these 56 teachers that were employed because most of us were employed under uh, internship contract. So we are worried like where is this government and why is the government lying to, lying to the nation. So we are, we are requesting the government to come out very clear and tell us exactly where are they. 56 teachers who are employed under uh, yes. under permanent and pension. The 56,000 teachers, eh? yes. uh, like if I'm very sure the teachers who are employed under uh, permanent and pensionable uh, conditions were how many? They were around, well, they, were very they were very few. few. So the 56,000 about the government's all over saying that were employed under, that he has employed to Nashanga.